In today's video, we're going to be talking all about the magic of Saturdays. Why Saturdays are so special, what rituals you could do on Saturdays, and all that fun stuff. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and hello if you're new. Make sure that you subscribe before you leave, that way you'll never miss out on another video. This entire week, I did a video every single day, because I get asked so many questions, what day of the week should I be doing what? So I decided to do this whole series where every single day this week I uploaded a video that explains the benefits of that day of the week, what you can do, what rituals you could do. So if you're interested and you missed out on Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, those videos are already up and today's Saturday. Saturdays are the day of letting go and protecting yourself. Saturdays correspond with Saturn energy, and Saturn energy is very protective energy and the energy of letting go, releasing, purging. Two crystals that are amazing to use on Saturdays are the Black Obsidian Crystal and Hematite Crystal. So I like to wear some crystals and then I also like to use the tumbled version. I love wearing Hematite on Saturdays especially. They're very, very healing, very protective, and very healing is like the best way I can describe a Hematite crystal. And then Black Obsidian is very grounding and very, very protective. Like this crystal protects your energy insanely. Another thing I like to do is wear black on Saturdays. It is a day of protection and letting go. Black is a color that heavily corresponds with those energies. So I like to wear black on Saturdays just to tap into and align with that energy even more. The first ritual that you could do on a Saturday that's going to be very powerful on a Saturday especially is to use sage to cleanse yourself down, to cleanse your house. This is the day you want to cleanse with sage or palo santo. If you don't have those things, you could just use incense. Just go to the dollar store, grab yourself some incense, light it up, and run it through your house. And so the smoke kind of goes and touches the walls and cleanses the walls. Same thing with sage and palo santo. You could light those up and make sure that you cleanse your whole body. And then you also do your whole entire house, the loved ones in your house. Um, and it's really good for cleansing away energy and letting go of any energy that does not belong there. And also just protection, protection energy, protection from evil eye, protection from negative energy. It's really, really good. The second thing you could do is to wear patchouli scented perfume on Saturday. Okay, this is very, very powerful. Patchouli is the herb of attraction, but on Saturday, we're going to be using the protection aspect of patchouli. So not only are we clearing and letting go and protecting ourselves, but we are also attracting. So when we do let go of something, there is this empty energy, right? Like there's, we're letting something go, so now we wanna bring in something good. So this is why patchouli perfume is amazing on Saturdays, because as soon as you release and let go, you have that patchouli there to bring in and attract all the good stuff, all the things that you want. I do want to share with you guys two of my favorite ways to use patchouli. So I have here patchouli perfume by Skylar. I'm not sponsored by them. I mentioned them in yesterday's video too. Um, I really like their perfume because it's all natural. Um, and it's really good for people with sensitive skin, pregnant women. Um, and it smells so good. It smells better than like heavy duty, expensive perfumes out there in my opinion. So this one here is coral and this one has patchouli, black currant, and sandalwood. It smells amazing. Like it smells so, so good. And I like to use this especially on Saturdays. Now, if you guys don't want that, I do have my Kali spray. This is up in my store right now. This is for protection, divine feminine energy. And there's a lot of patchouli in here. One of the main ingredients is patchouli. So if you guys are interested in this, I love using this on Saturdays and on Tuesdays. This is really, really good. It really, I feel like every time I use this, I... It's a whole new um, energy for me. I feel protected and I feel secure and I feel safe. You could also burn patchouli incense and patchouli candles on a Saturday. It enhances the protection in your life and it just protects your mind, body, your spirit, and your energy. Patchouli also corresponds very heavily with Saturn energy, so it's really good to use on Saturdays to tap into that. The third ritual that you can do on a Saturday is to infuse your water with a black obsidian crystal. Black obsidian corresponds with Saturn energy and it's also a very, very protective stone. So what you want to do is just take a tumbled stone right here. I do have these up in my store if you guys are interested. Um, but just take one and put it in your water and infuse your water with the intention of protection, letting go of everything that no longer serves you, opening your roads, removing obstacles. Black Obsidian also helps to remove emotional blockages. So that's another reason that I really love working with this on Saturdays is I want to really tap into that energy of removing 
things within me that don't belong there. It gives mental clarity and it also helps you release everything that no longer serves you. So those are three things you could do on a Saturday. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, found it useful. Thank you so much for watching. If you missed out on Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, those are all up and I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll talk to you very, very soon.